Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix when you are unable to install MyDell app on your Dell computer. So over here, you can see you don't see the install option, but it says that this app is not compatible with this device. Now, before we troubleshoot, uh, here you can read available on Dell XPS, Inspiron, G series and Vostro PCs purchased in September 2018 or later Dell PCs purchased before September 2018 will not have all the features enabled. Now to go ahead and fix this error message, open command prompt. So go ahead and type in CMD in Windows search box and then make a right click on command prompt app, then click on run as administrator, then click on yes to allow. And once you have the command prompt, go ahead and run these two command. All the commands are provided in the video description. Make a right click, copy this command and then paste it in the command prompt window and then hit the enter key. Now you have to go ahead and run the second command as well. Now this is for Dell Inspiron. I have tested in on my Inspiron computer. So paste it over here, hit the enter key. So once this is done, you can go ahead and close command prompt and then you have to go ahead and restart your computer. Now the restart is very important. So go to the start menu, then click on the power icon, then click on restart. And after the system restart, you can go ahead and type in store and then open Microsoft store. And in the search box, you can go ahead and type in my Dell and then click on Dell app. Now, after the system restart, you should be able to see the install option over here. So over here, you can see the get option. So click on get. And this should go ahead and download and install the file on your Dell computer. Now, in case if you have XPS, so instead of Inspiron, you can go ahead and rename it as XPS. I have not tried this, but I think this is going to work. So if you have XPS, go ahead and just replace Inspiron with XPS Dell underscore XPS and then try the command. And here you can see it's downloading and that should go ahead and fix the error message but still you are unable to download in that case you can go ahead and perform ws reset command so you can go ahead and type in ws reset in windows search box and then click on ws reset now once you click on ws reset it will open a black window do not close this black screen this black screen will go away and it will go ahead and open microsoft store and after you have microsoft store you can go ahead and try to download the application once again so that'll be all. Thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel.